Hey guys, Paul Wilson here from Fat Burner Bootcamp and I'm just sending out and answering your questions right now live on Facebook um, and Ayman Aurora. Ayman, I'm going to call you for the purposes of this, this video, Heman. Um, Heman has just asked, hi Paul, my biggest problem is I find it very difficult to stay motivated uh, in my weight loss. I seem to see results fast, but when I have that moment of lapse of concentration, I seem to forget about all my concentration and end up in the same cycle of eating crap food. You're not the only one, hey man, hey man. Uh, and drinking, etc. Um, so I do tend to try and cut out all the crap. Is there any way to lose weight effectively without going to extremes? Thus, not for falling to temptation. Totally, uh, hey man. No, you know what? Because as I always say, that weight loss is a battle. And depending on how out of shape you are, is going to determine the amount of um, the the bigger battle you've got on your hands. Okay, so wherever you are right now with your weight loss, you've got to um, you know that that's going to determine how much effort, how much focus you're going to have to put in. You got yourself out of shape. Only you can put yourself back in shape. I don't mean to like pull any wall of your eyes or sugar coat sugar coat it. But that's the so, so, solid hard truth, guys. Um, so, uh, Amen, here's what I would do. Here's what I would do. Firstly, I'd change my name to He-Man and, uh, and believe that I've got the power. And um, I would start making things a bit more practical. For me, so my mind's always focused. And to do that, I would start surrounding myself with positive people. People that are eating clean, people that have probably just got an awesome result, uh, people that will want to puff you up, you know, bring you to the next level. However, as people, yourself, hey man, I'm sure you do it, and a lot of other people watching this video right now, we tend to surround ourselves in environments with people that give us options to eat that slice of cake or have that pint of beer or that glass of wine, okay? Now, if you're surrounding yourself in that situation, you're always going to fall down, okay? But if you're going to start surrounding yourself with like-minded people who want the results that you want, then it's going to bring you up and it's going to be like the dumb thing to do is eat clean and train hard, etc. because everybody else is doing it and it kind of changes your routine. That's what you've got to do. So practically, I would surround myself in that environment. You control your environment, so you change it to how you want to live your life. But if you keep falling off the bandwagon or you keep looking for an easy way out, then you're your own worst enemy. Remember, weight loss is a battle. Um, don't try and, you know, um, go easy on yourself, okay? You've got to be determined. You've got to be focused. And um, don't accept any excuses. So, what else can I add to that? Um, I'd also just completely change around my diet. So, if I'm eating crap... I would, well, you know, look on the fatburnerbootcamp.com forward slash blog. There's a few recipes up on there. And start trying those recipes and make cooking fun and exciting so it kind of becomes your new habit, your new, your new, um, your new routine sort of thing. And that's what you want to do, guys. Replace bad habits for healthy habits. Make it more fun and interesting. And, um, and that will change your mindset. That will change the way that you see things and, and think of weight loss okay so I hope that helps Iman um, and also with exercise with exercise just make sure you're putting in you know you're, you're a lot of effort in, in, into those workouts into those sessions and at the same time you're getting the recovery in as well my dogs are barking I've got to go guys keep the questions coming to facebook.com forward slash fatboneybootcamp or info at fatboneybootcamp.com thank you very much